What's up guys, this is Andy with My Tech Methods and this is the top 10 best free iPhone games of 2014. All right, let's go ahead and kick this list off with Quiz Up. If you're a fan of trivia and pop culture, this is the game for you. I'm a big fan of trivia and pop culture and TV shows. There's a huge selection of topics on here. What, what, what it is basically you is you is choose a topic and then you play against somebody around the world in a round of like five questions trivia pertaining on that topic. So, and I'm gonna show you how it works real quick. I'm gonna do 90s music and we're gonna play against somebody and see. Let's see, here we go. Okay, round one. Complete the name of the 90s boy band, 98 Degrees. All right, cool. Um, wasn't a big fan. I was more instinct, Backstreet Boys kind of guy. Deborah Cox had a hit record with nobody's supposed to love me. I don't even know who Deborah Cox is. Christina Aguilera released Ginny in 1999, duh. 1993, come on. She was like four. Which 90s was I don't. What, what does it say? I don't know. I don't know what... So when, it, when it says Prince, I don't even look at the question. That's that's one of my rules. How many members were there in... Oh, there was three. I was like... Well, it was, uh, 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 yes, yes, no, yes. All right, last round. Oh, God, here we go. Complete the title. Jagged Little Pill. Oh, yes. Ooh, one by one. That's why I love this game. It's so nerve-wracking. It just keeps you on the edge of the seat the whole time. That is um, how you play Quiz Up. It's really fun. And the faster you answer a question, the more points you get. So you have to be quick, you know? So it's not just, you don't have to just get it right. You have to be faster than your opponent. Okay, so that's why it's so, so fun. All right, this next game is called 2048. It's a really fun game. I'm gonna show you how it works really quick. Basically, you join the numbers to get to the 2048 tile. What you have to do is, is move the tiles left, right, up, down, and you have to match the numbers. So, um, see, I got two fours. If I move it to the left, then they're going to it's going to turn into eight. Okay, and then I got two twos on the bottom, so I can move to the right, and it's going to do four. So, once you see two tiles that you can match up, just move it that direction. So I got two eights. I'm going to move down, and then it's just going to double that number. Those two numbers are going to join, and then you you basically have to work your way up all the way to the number 2048 if you can. Uh, so just move up and down. There's two fours. Okay, and then so. Yeah, you'll get the hang of it. Just play it and you'll be on this for hours and you're going to dream about the number 2, 4, 8, 16, 30. You're going to dream of those numbers, I promise you. You're going to have nightmares. Uh, this is a really fun game, 2048. All right, this next game is called Jupiter Jump. This will make you want to throw your phone across the room. Okay, and I'm going to show you how it works really quickly. If you are, uh, if you've ever played uh, the game Copter, like Helicopter, then it's kind of like that. Okay, so basically you have this little guy on Jupiter and he's just bouncing. You have to, all you gotta do is make him bounce and avoid um, obstacles like grenades. And you have to, there's stuff that you have to hit. So I'm gonna show you how to re really quickly how, to, how it works here. So every time you press on the screen, the guy jump, the guy will, will bounce basically. And that's all there is to it. Here we go. And the green, you gotta hit the green to get a power up, so. It's really hard. It, it, it looks easy, but it's, oh God, it's so hard. It, you'll, you'll get confused. So um, I, I suck at this game, obviously, but it's fun, it's fun to play. And that is called uh, Jupiter Jump. All right, this next app is called Smash Hit. This is a pretty fun game. Uh, and basically you, you bust glass with balls. <laughs> but it, it looks really good too. That's the thing about this, it looks really nice. Okay, so tap to throw balls and you're just gonna break glass wow I, I can't do it from this angle but yeah you're just gonna break glass for points I'm terrible wow yeah that's all there is to it uh, it's really fun though once you start getting into more glass here and you got to avoid this glass you can't hit glass or you'll you'll get hit and lose points okay so there you go I crashed lost 10 balls don't run into doors you'll lose balls that game is called smash it really fun and this next game is called paper rama uh, remember back in school when you used to make little origami shapes out of paper? Well, somebody in their ingenious mind brought that to the iPhone in a game, and it's really fun and really challenging. So, I'll show you how to play it real quick. It's really simple. Just choose a level. I'm gonna show you just how, how it works here. You're gonna fold, fold the paper into what shape it, it tells you to. And there you go. You get stars, you have to get it perfect. If you don't get it perfect, you get two stars or one star. Uh, but it does get really, really challenging 
and you'll be sitting here. It, it really makes you think, makes you want to pull out like real paper and try it on real paper, try the shapes and just see what works. Because in your mind, it's hard to figure out what shapes can go into the, into the, the shapes it gives you. So um, I won't show you anymore. That's basically what it is. Go ahead and check it out. That's called Paperama. One of the, the fun, funner games out there that I found for the iPhone. Now those were five of my favorite free iPhone games of 2014. Now I'm gonna throw it to my buddy Jonathan from the channel Today's Free Apps and he's gonna show you five of his favorite games on the iPhone. Thanks Andy for letting me be part of your video today, man. I really do appreciate it. So here is my five free games, so let's get right into it. This first app is called Jump 50 and this game may look easy, but it's really not. It's very difficult. You have 50 rounds in this game that you go through and you jump over roadblocks and you just try to jump over each one without crashing. So it looks easy, but it's very difficult, but it's quite addictive. So go check it out, Jump 50. This next game is called 100 Balls, and the purpose of this game is to fill the moving cups with the falling balls. The filled cups will then return back to the pot and you can keep going. The game will speed up as the level progresses and the game will end when all the balls or cups are lost. So this game is quite addictive, so go check it out in the App Store, 100 Balls. This next game is called Dark Lands, and this is a battle runner action game where you take your character on an epic journey of defeating evil forces who corrupt the land. You will fight enemies like goblins, skeletons, and trolls, so go check this app out in the App Store. I'm sure you're going to like it. This next game is called Bill Kill em, and this is a retro action game. In this game, you run the rooftops of LA and you fight against alien forces. Now this game is free, but it does have in-app purchases if you want to advance more in the game. So go check it out in the app store, Bill Kill em. This next game is called Go Go Ghost and you sprint through the town of Ghostville and you have to avoid pitfalls. You have to dodge deadly monsters to save your town. So I'm really liking this game. It's The graphics are pretty cool. So go check it out in the App Store, Go Go Ghost. So a big thank you to Jonathan for sharing those apps with us. Uh, if you guys want to go subscribe to his channel, I'll leave the link down in the description below or you can click on the annotation on the video to his channel. He does a lot of uh, cool videos on iPhone apps and all that good stuff. So check out his channel and subscribe to this channel as well if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any other apps that you want to share with us and uh, just leave a comment down below. And, and tell us what apps that we need to check out uh, for the iPhone. So thank you so much for watching. Keep having fun out there, and I will talk to you later. Bye.